What up, though? Heist Man the Foe. Talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions. Man, Sandra Bullock, she must be having buyer's remorse. I don't think she like her purchases that she made. Y'all know what I'm talking about. The black baby she got. Or AKA the knee accessories. Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. Y'all remember back in the days when all those um celebrities, they was going out buying babies, man. I think they go down to black babies are rust and they look at the clearance rack, pick them a little baby out to go with their outfit. You know, they was wearing them like purses and stuff, man. Y'all remember all them celebrities, they was doing it, man. It was like Madonna, she had her few black babies. I think, um, what's her name? Charlize Theron had her little black baby, a little knee accessory. What's this woman name? Connie Britton, she had a little knee accessory. Angelina Jolie. I'm talking about everybody had one, man, but that ain't what we talking about right now. We talking about this lady right here, Sandra Bullock. She said some stuff, man. She went on the Red Table Talk. With Jada Pickett Smith, y'all know the Red Table Talk they had on, what's my man's name? Will Smith crying all over the place. But Sandra Bullock, she had some stuff to say when she went on that, man. Check this out. Listen to what she said. To say that I wish our skins matched, sometimes I do. Yeah, of Because course. then it would be easier it on how people easier. approach us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. I don't know, man. She she was saying, like, she wish her babies could be the same color as her. I, I kind of see where she was going at, but... I don't know. I don't think that was the right thing for her to say. I don't think her baby should be hearing that um, that that she want him to be the same color because like you chose that baby, you picked that baby out. So don't try to go back on it now. And try to renege. You know what I mean? Like I think she loved her her child that she have, but saying stuff like that it, it, it just ain't right. You know? Cause the baby gonna hear this one day and she gonna be thinking like, if you see my son, I'm gonna. Big old black dude. My son, he mixed. And he look like Jesus. Like, long hair. He look like Jesus. They kind of remind me of the story back in the days. Like, I say he was probably about three years old. Me, him, his mama. We went out to dinner one day. And when we was waiting to get seated, a white family came out. And the little boy, he was like, is that your son? I was like, yeah. He said, why he not black like you? Well, he said brown. He said, why he not brown like you? And before I can say something, the mama, she snatch her son up real quick and it started apologizing real crazy like oh no no i'm like man if i could have got to say what i wanted to say because i was gonna say something to the little boy probably scarred him for life but i don't know but sandra bullock accept what you got that's your baby don't be trying to wish i mean like i said i see where you coming from because the world we live in now you think stuff can be a little different but mm, this maybe one of the best words to say but we definitely gonna be talking about this Friday right here on this channel because I go live every Friday talking about stuff just like this. Y'all got to come through and holler at me, man. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you got to hit to get this pimping that I'm putting out when I put it out. And like I said, I go live every Friday talking about stuff just like this. Come through and holler at me. If you're on the Stop Capping Podcast, come over here to the Talk That Talk Ghetto News channel and holler at your boy. Heist Man the folks. Talk That Talk Ghetto News and Opinions. Peace.